Our country is being crippled by brain disorders like Alzheimer's and Parkinson's. There are more than 4.5 million Alzheimer's patients in this country alone. The problem is that we might be treating some of the symptoms of Alzheimer's, but in reality, we're not really doing anything to prevent the disease. And that's a real problem when we know that we can actually prevent Alzheimer's disease. Dr. David Perlmutter is a board-certified neurologist who has attracted worldwide attention for his unique and pioneering advances in the treatment and prevention of neurological diseases. The author of The Better Brain Book and BrainRecovery.com, Dr. Perlmutter is the medical director of the Perlmutter Health Center and the Perlmutter Hyperbaric Center in Naples, Florida. A leader in the field of nutritional influences in brain disorders, Dr. Perlmutter has developed a groundbreaking treatment for patients suffering from Parkinson's disease in conjunction with major universities throughout the country. His scientific publications have appeared in some of the most respected medical journals, and he lectures to the public and to the medical community on his innovative work in preventing such devastating illnesses as Alzheimer's, Parkinson's, and multiple sclerosis. I deal with patients and families every day here in this office dealing with life-threatening disorders and the issue to me that is most important is that these diseases can absolutely be prevented. We really don't have any good effective treatments for Alzheimer's disease and yet we know that science now tells us that that disease can in fact be prevented. That's the reason that I wrote our new book, The Better Brain Book. In that book people will find all of the tools necessary that they can use to learn how to implement programs to prevent diseases like Alzheimer's, Parkinson's, and even effective new and exciting treatments for multiple sclerosis. What do you do to get your head back in the game? We're asking the author of Better Brain Book, the best tools for improving memory and sharpness and for preventing aging of the brain. Dr. David Perlmutter. This is great news. I didn't know I could do that. You can actually slow up the aging process for the brain, Doctor. We hear about heart healthy, but we never really think about your brain health. Why is that, do you think? Unclear. I mean, I think most people really pay attention to things like the heart and their muscles and know that there's things that they can do to get those organs in shape. But in reality, there's a lot that we can do to get our brains functioning better and to stave off things like Alzheimer's. Now, in your book, you say that forgetfulness could be a result of a distressed brain. What exactly does that mean? Well, absolutely. You know, the brain does age with time, as does the rest of our bodies, but we can actually preserve brain health, and while we work on keeping our bodies healthy, we can do things to maintain the health of our brain long into our 80s and 90s. The important news is that Alzheimer's is a preventable disease, and more importantly, we know we don't have any medical cure for that problem right now. If we are at risk, that is, if it is in our genes, our parents had it, our grandparents had Alzheimer's, uh, it really doesn't matter what we eat or what supplements we take, does it? Well, it matters a whole heck of a lot, David, with all due respect. And that is to say, Alzheimer's is not a genetically determined disease. You may have a genetic predisposition, but we now know that with the proper medical testing, which should be done at the time of your physical examination, we can override those genetic determinants and really uh, give you the options of not having Alzheimer's disease. The point is, it is a preventable disease for which we have no cure. Again, it's a question of if you don't use it, you're going to lose it. I know one of the things that you suggest in the book is taking stock, inventory, doing a, a brain audit. Right. We have a 45-point uh, uh, brain audit that will allow you to know exactly where you are in terms of risk for crippling brain disease. tell you exactly what you need to do nutritionally and lifestyle-wise to reduce your risk of these potentially uh, life-threatening diseases, which we now know are preventable. We've now received full FDA approval for our research using intravenous glutathione, and that will be completed in December of this and, year. And that's uh, effective for Parkinson's? It is remarkably effective. So the point is, as John Kennedy said in his inauguration, the time to fix the roof is when the sun is shining. Mm -hmm. We can prevent Alzheimer's disease, and we now have the tools, and that's what the book is all about. It's got, it's got some really interesting things in here, like about alarm clocks, don't sleep with one next to your head, and exactly. on the electric blankets, and great stuff in here. Dr. David Perlmutter, thanks so much. Thank you. The word doctor comes from the Latin, not meaning healer, but it means teacher, and I really feel that that's my mission, to get this information out to the public. When you spend your day in this office and deal with families and patients who are dying from these disorders and realize that mainstream medicine has very little to offer them, you really have to ask yourself, how could we have prevented this disease in the first place? And in fact, 
those techniques are now readily available to us and need to be used. I think the thing that makes our practice unique is that we are willing to take cutting-edge medical research and go ahead and put it into practice today and not wait 10 years till these things have been so-called proven. I think it's my mission to make this information widely known. We can prevent this disease and alleviate a lot of heartache.